We have a Whirlpool Refrigerator Serial 3. Can you guesstimate how old your Whirlpool is? And just to clarify, what's the exact model? Serial hashtag W1050528282 and it is about 3.5 years old. We are getting a lot of water in the pullout drawer. Any suggestions? Do you plan on doing the work yourself? If I can. Anything else we should know to help you best? I just want to know what I need to do to get rid of the water in the drawer. Everything gets wet. Hello. My name is I'll be helping you with your appliance question today. Please wait a few moments while I review your question. Do you have a full model number so I can better assist you? It should be located on a sticker near the ceiling of the refrigerator section and seen if you just open the refrigerator door. Also, what drawer exactly are you getting a lot of water in? WRX 988 Sigmo. The pullout is the one below the refrigerator. Okay, got it. You can't really remove that pullout drawer. But if you open the refrigerator and remove the crisper drawers and such, open the pull-out drawer and you can see a vented cover panel against the back wall which is part 35 on the diagram attached below. Unscrew this cover panel and you'll see silver evaporator coils. There is a drain trough below the coils and the drain hole in the center is clogged so you'll need to clear it by shooting hot water with a turkey baster. Once it's cleared, clean all the water up and reinstall the panel. Then you should be good to go again. We are on the honor system here. If you need anything else, just let me know. You can continue asking follow-up questions at no additional charge after rating my service if you still need assistance. I pulled all the crispers and drawer liner out and looked behind and found a huge block of ice around the panel. We are going to thaw it out with a hair dryer to see if I can get the panel off. I didn't see any screws on the cover but there is a lot of ice around it. Okay that is a very common issue. It's not defrosting properly. There is no defrost heater. You'll need to turn the refrigerator off and use a hair dryer and thaw out all that ice as well as then remove the back cover panel and thaw out behind the panel as well because the silver coils will be packed with ice. It's a design issue but if you thaw it out you should be good to go again. Since there is no defrost heater, if you leave the door open too long or turn the refrigerator too cold, it can cause the evaporator to not thaw out properly and then you run into this issue. I am not sure what panel we need to remove. Do you mean we need to pull the refrigerator away from the wall and go in from the back or just the plastic one part number 35? No, you don't need to pull the refrigerator out. This is still panel 35 that you need to remove. There is a panel with rollers on it that the crisper drawers slide in and out on. Can that be removed? It looks like you have to, to be able to get to the coils. Yes, you can remove that but I'm not there so I can't say what is specifically involved to remove that without being there. The lights went out in the refrigerator. We could not figure out how to turn off the refer without pulling the plug. Is the lights going out something programmed to do when the doors are open too long? The control panel still has power to it. The light went out from having the door open too long. You just have to close the doors, unplug the refrigerator for 5 minutes, and plug it back in and the light will reset. Until I can figure a way to get the shelf panel with the rollers on it out. I can't see being able to remove part number 35. 
We got the external ice out and thawed most of it out but the shelf prevents getting the coil cover off. I unplugged the refer a few minutes ago and we will rest it. I can send you the pages from the service manual that explain how to remove these parts if you'd like, but that's normally an additional charge so if you wanted this you would at least need to rate me before I send something like that over. Thank you. Attached are the documents on taking the refrigerator apart. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.